Hi, and welcome to the Home Assistant How-To with Beardy Thinker. Today, we are going to configure a Workday Sensor. We'll start in 10 seconds. In today's episode, we are going to configure Workday Sensor. What is Workday Sensor? It is a very simple sensor, but very powerful, and it will help you in future automations. It can distinguish based on the country and the holiday calendar, in what country you live, what are work days, what days are holidays. And this can be used to help you with automations such as heating, uh, morning lights in the winter, or air conditioning and things like that. How I use it, it distinguishes on what days I have work days, what days are holidays and weekend. Uh, on work days at predefined time, uh, before my alarm goes off, uh, they start to light up the apartment. Let's get started with configuring Workday Sensor. It is pretty simple. Once again, we will go to our configurator. If you still haven't created a binary sensor file, uh, you can watch my Meta Alarm episode. What we did is in configuration file, we added binary sensor YAML file, and now we are keeping our binary sensor information inside binary sensor YAML. Okay, so what we said today, we are going to define Workday Sensor. Let's give it description, Workday Sensor. Platform for this is Workday. And now we have to define a couple of necessary a uh, couple of mandatory fields. For example, one of the fields that is necessary is country. So my country is HR for Croatia or Hrvatska. Uh, you have to use two letter name of the country. Next thing what we have to do or what we can do is we can define workdays. Uh, if for example, you have some weird uh, work schedule, you can put it so Monday, Tuesday and Friday. So it will know that you only work on Monday, Tuesdays and Fridays. I myself would love that schedule, but unfortunately mine is whole week. <laughs> Next thing that we can do is we can define excludes. And those excludes can be, if you, for example, have different work week, that can be, for example, Tuesday and Thursday and Saturday, and your work day can be Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. For me, this is Saturday, Sunday, and I don't work on holidays. Those are, let's say, mandatory fields if you want to get everything right. But what we also can do, we can define some personal holidays or vacation times. Then I will do it here just for example. I will not be working on 2019, 12, 26th. And I will not be working on 2019, 12, 31st. Well, I will be working on 31st, but that's a different story. This is it. We are finished with the configuration. Let's press save. And what we did, we defined our country. So the system will pull uh, from the internet country specific holidays. We have defined that my work days are Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Let's add column here. And we have defined that my excludes from the work days are Saturday, Sunday, and holidays. Also, we added a couple of uh, personal holidays. For example, this can be used for vacation. Let's press save once again. Let's go to the configuration, server control, check our configuration. Hopefully everything is okay. And we'll now restart our server. And our server is back online. Okay, let's go to overview. And let's define a 
and let's add here our workday sensor. Okay, save. And as you can see, our workday sensor for today is off, and that's correct because today it's Sunday. That's it. Of course, you are now free to add this to your automations and use it where and when you need it. Thank you once again for watching Home Assistant How To with Bearded Thinker. I hope you enjoyed this episode and it was useful. If you have any suggestion or a comment, uh, any specific component you would like me to record tutorial on, please leave that comment down in the comment section. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you still haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit the bell button so you get notified on future updates. And I will be seeing you in the next Home Assistant How-To. Thank you for watching once again. Have fun and bye-bye.